Hi, and welcome to Take Time to Create. Today, I'm going to show you how to decorate this straw hat. I found these straw hats at the dollar store and thought they were just super duper cute. And you can see that they've got this really pretty little ribbon around the band and it was just plain, had nothing on the brim. And I thought, well, it's cute, but it needed a little something. So I went ahead and sharpied on some flowers and I'm going to show you how I did that. Let me scoot that one over. I have a plain one right here, and this one has a black band. And I thought it looked nice, and it does look very good. It's a classy looking hat. But I wanted to add something extra to it. So I have a permanent marker. And what I'm going to do with this permanent marker is just make some swirls. I wanted it a little abstract and I'm just going to swirl around. Freehand, it's okay if you don't like it. If you get it from the dollar store, that's okay. It was a dollar, not a big deal. And we're going to swirl around and I go over it a couple times because it's hard to get on all those nooks and crannies and crevices. Just, just go over it a couple times. It's all right and if it smears a little, it's okay. No big deal, and just go ahead and go around and up and over. And these swirls are gonna go here and there and every which way. And we'll just keep on going and bring it on down. And we're going to swirl here. This doesn't take very long to do this. This is a great project to do with kids. If you have a group of people for, uh, if you have a group of girls out, even young girls or adult girls, right before a girls weekend at the beach, everybody needs to have a sun hat. So if everybody decorates their own and it's pretty neat to see how people will decorate them because everybody's got a different idea on what their hat should look like. And now you can decorate the top of the hat, the crown, you can decorate underneath the brim, you can decorate almost anywhere on this. You can change out the ribbon. Like I said, I got this one at the dollar store. And so there's all kinds of opportunities to decorate it, to change it, to alter it. And like I said, it came from the dollar store. Not a big deal if it doesn't turn out nice or if I don't like it. Or, you know, if I don't like it, I can always just paint over it. Just get some acrylic paint, paint the whole hat, and then all of a sudden, ta-da, I have a new hat. Not a big deal. It's just markers. All right, I'm getting almost done with the black. And we're gonna swirl it on around. And I'm going to lift up, don't forget to lift up the ribbon because you wanna get, the ribbon will blow around. Now this hat won't travel very well in your suitcase. It doesn't crush very well. This top, if, if it gets um, smashed, I don't think it'll come back. You could travel if you put you know, socks and underwear in there to keep the brim from crushing or the, the, the top from crushing. But uh, if you if you can't do that, then I wouldn't travel with it. Uh, all right. So I have the top done. Now I want to add some detail. As pretty as this is, and you can leave it like this, and it looks pretty great. But I thought I would add a little bit of gray just to accent my my little swirls here. And I'm just going to accent just a little bit, just to make them a little beefier just to accent, bring it on around. And I'm just accenting just a little bit, just the swirl part. Now you don't have to do this, you can leave it the way it is, but I thought it needed just a little bit, just a little bit more. I like to uh, add detail. Sometimes I add too much detail, sometimes I uh, take things too far, but I think in this case, just a little bit is what it needs. Uh, I don't think it's too much. Um, once again, just keep going over it just a little bit. The, the first pass with the Sharpie isn't enough. And this is a Sharpie. Any permanent marker will do. Uh, paint markers would work great with this. And just make sure you do paint markers if you need to in a well-ventilated area. And 
let's swirl this around. We've got this gray with this black. Uh, red and white would have looked really great with this. All kinds of options and just the sky's the limit, just your imagination. Go ahead and pick up a few. I was tempted to pick up more than just two hats, but then I thought, well, I really don't need more than two hats, but it's just so tempting and it's so much fun just to decorate hats and decorate whatever you get. That way it's not all the same and I don't look like everybody else. It's it's fun to put my own stamp on things. I also keep these hats in my car, in my husband's car, because I like to make sure I have a hat just in case we find ourselves outside, we're going for a walk, we go for a walk from after work, go to my parents' house, we have a picnic. It's nice to have a car, a hat, <laughs> sorry, it's nice to have a hat in the car so that you can protect yourself from the sun. Always a good idea. And I think I'll fast forward the video here so we can finish this up. Okay, we are on the last two swirls. All right, bring it on around. Almost looks a little like a starry night here. Nothing beats a swirl. Nice and easy. Anybody can draw a swirl, which I really like because sometimes my drawing is not that great. So it's nice just to be able to do something easy and personalize this. And nobody will mistake my hat at the swimming pool. Everybody will know this is mine. Or maybe they might want to take it anyway. That's okay. All right. <clears throat> there we have it. Nice and easy. I'm just going back and just making sure it's all filled in and I might come back another day and if I see something that needs a little bit more filled in, no big deal. Just go ahead and fill it in. Mm, debating on if I want to add some dots to go with it. Just to bring in a little more detail. Not sure. I think I'm going to leave it just like this. But if you want, you can add some dots. You know, just put little circles around. But I, I think with the two colors, I think we're good. I think we have enough. Rhinestones would look really great on this. If you add rhinestones or beads or some really cute stickers, there's all kinds of things you can do to the brim. So the imagination, just run away with it. Just go to town and make your hat as fantastic as you are. Thank you for watching and don't forget to follow me on Facebook and Instagram and subscribe to my channel for more videos. And remember to take time to create new and wonderful things. Thanks for watching.